Good morning, sleepyhead one and sleepyhead two. Couldn't wake up this morning, so it's about eight o'clock now, but we're feeling decently rested and getting ready to hit the trail. Well, hitting the trail already. And uh, I got about 18 miles to do today. That'll put us like right at the bottom of Killington for tomorrow. And uh, that'll actually get us into town a day earlier than what we had planned. So that'll be nice. And we'll figure out what we're going to do from there. Camper, fast break, and spice all left earlier this morning. So hopefully we can catch up to them eventually. But probably we'll just see them at the end of the day. And then tomorrow will be a quick in and out town day. As well as going up over... Mount Killington. That'll be our first 4,000 foot peak since uh, Georgia. Well, probably not since Georgia, but you know, since Virginia or something. It's been a long time. And it'll actually be Fast Break and Spice's first 4,000 foot peak. So we're all looking forward to it. And the uh, temperature's been really nice. It's starting to cool off as we get higher in elevation and farther north. So we're Really enjoying it out here. up after everybody this morning I headed out sometime around eight o'clock this morning so we're about a mile and a half or two miles behind uh spice fast break and camper so we're trying to hurry and catch them so they said there's some place right off the trail that they're gonna try to get something to eat at i guess and we don't want to keep them waiting and we also would like to get something to eat there because it's lunchtime now but still like three and a half miles away probably. So we're trying to hustle. hurry up. Yeah, we're trying to hustle. So um, anyway, yeah, that's what we're, hopefully we can get something to eat, maybe something to drink. Maybe they got ice cream. That sounds good. It's pretty hot out today, even though the high is only 75. Feels like a million. So I think it's definitely hotter than seventy. Yeah, I would agree with that. So, all right, that's why we're hustling. Look how red my face is, man. Because I just finished climbing up a huge mountain with no name. Okay. Look how red my shirt is. <laughs> oh yeah, your shirt is just bringing out the redness in my face. Yeah. Or it's my face bringing out the redness in your shirt. We compliment each other. <laughs> We've got some sad news. The deli is closed on weekends. So we're just gonna grab some lunch real quick at the shelter and then try and catch up to everybody. They're getting closer to the gorge, Clarendon Gorge where you can swim. So we're assuming they'll probably be down there for a little while. So hopefully we can snack real quick and then uh, catch up. We just got word that there is one brown sugar spotted in our area. So we're on the lookout. Hoping that they're up here on this shelf at this shelter. <laughs> we heard there's also some beer at this shelter, so we're like potential. Potentially some beer for a celebration with some friends we haven't seen in 17, I mean 1400 miles. 
Yeah, so we're pretty sure we're about to see him up here because, I mean, you know, free beer, who can turn that down? And old friends, who could turn that down? Sir, we'll keep you updated. Um, we just crossed the road and did not expect to see this today. 500 miles. How do you feel? 500 miles to Katahdin. It feels like we're almost there. <laughs> <sighs> That's so exciting. Man, we waited a long time to see that sign. 500 miles. 500 miles left. <sighs>